Hello everyone, welcome to the channel, Rad here from Rad Gutsarot and this is going to be a recent Aries Moon and uh, Aries Rising monthly tarot reading for February 2019 and uh, while I'm shuffling the cards once again I want to remind you that uh, this is going to be a general reading uh, for Aries star sign and uh, for that reason is going to resonate differently with uh, every single different Aries so in this video uh, I will try my best to explain you the meanings of the cards and as well their synergy in the spread uh, as well I'm going to try to give you a few examples here but ultimately uh, you have to align your personal situations uh, with the reading for maximum accuracy if you want me to do that for you just like I'm doing for the examples in this video or in other words to analyze your situation through tarot that is a subject of a personal reading and uh, for personal readings uh, you can check out my website which is uh, listed down below in the description of this video and uh, there you are going to find a full list of my services as well as their pricing and also this is going to be an enhanced tarot spread which means that I'm going to draw additional cards per position <clears throat> so the month is starting rather well here with uh, the judgment card as the judgment card is about the wake up call uh, you can take it as uh, that this is going to manifest in a severely difficult field um, in your life so if you are facing huge predicaments and you are wondering what to do into your uh, relationship or in generally into your romantic life then this is where that card is going to manifest if you are wondering what to do with your career you know and uh, you basically don't know what direction you should take there then this is where that card is going to manifest usually the the judgment card is about a, a breakthrough a, a severe breakthrough uh, which comes usually out of nowhere it kind of like it manifests itself through uh, surprising circumstances or sometimes as well it's, it it manifests itself th through a uh, a sudden insight as well you know wondering what to do scampering around and wobbling upon options available which are not ideal suddenly you know you obtain the insight <clears throat> of what exactly you need to do in order to uh, to make yourself beneficial from the situation itself again either into your career or either into your relationship for that reason the judgment card it kind of plays a role of uh, it's not really of a different perspective but let's say different view upon the situation at hand and upon the undertaking at hand and as we do have additionally two of wands there you are likely to find in this field that there are uh, there is so much more room for you to to grow as the two of wands is about aggressive push and also it's about developing and an exciting skills that you do have so just to give you an example here uh, let's say that uh, you are a, a single for a, quite a while now and um, no matter not no matter but rather like every time you try to approach someone I things aren't working out very well and etc etc and uh, basically at the end you are left alone once again well with these cards it is rather likely that throughout this month you are going to find that your strength into mesmerize and enthralling people intimately wise lies into a, a <clears throat> ability of yours or a skill of yours you know or attitude as well of yours which you are kind of like left underdeveloped and throughout this month you most likely are going to develop it and is going to reach a, a great great result and same kind of like example can be incorporated into one career as well but the point here is is that you are going to find a, a skill or a um, ability of yours which can uh, which is going to make you which is going to offer you a breakthrough or rather like will make you capable to do a breakthrough in a field in your life which you are facing uh, a setback or rather you are hitting a wall at that specific point now the next card that we do have speaks for the milestone that you are to reach this is the uh, attitude or rather like the intentions you should incorporate 
in this month in the six of wands it's all about collecting the fruits of your labor being recognized so if we're following the example here by being single when then then this car says that you have to step outside of your home you need to step under the the, <clears throat> the spotlights show yourself show your presence you know so you can re receive a recognition for who you are very very important so in that specific case this card speaks for courage uh, shyness is not a, a thing or rather like it's not a quality that it is that it can be a, a virtue throughout this month and you have to be a little bit more i don't i can't say more aggressive you know but let's say more courageous when you approach people so in case you're single i could conclude here that uh it is because you're i don't know you're way too cautious when you approach someone that is why most likely things aren't working at least with the speed that you are expecting to uh to work out and with the uh, with the Knights of Pentacles here, <clears throat> it does it, it kind of like consolidates the uh, the opinion that I just gave that you kind of like want too much warranties for is the thing going to work out? Difficult to explain, but let's say that you. Uh, you may think that throughout this month you have to play on secure. Uh, it's kind of like taking no uh, risks whatsoever. And that is the wrong approach toward the situation. The more the Knights of Pentacles, which is the secure, play, play the meticulous uh, performance, the, mat the meticulous planning and the simplicity takes place, the less you will have to get from the uh, from the six of wands, which is the recognition, the rewards, and etc. etc. So you have to be more courageous throughout the month. If you want something, you simply say that you want it. If you want to uh, do something, simply do it, and etc. etc. Do not try to get, let's say, constantly approval of a specific person, or <clears throat> you know, um, try to. I don't know how to say it really, but. Uh, do not aim to secure uh, the further development to a hundred percent and to minimize the risks to a hundred percent because that will never be uh, never be possible as soon as the opportunity here arises through as I say through either a surprising circumstances or through a sudden insight you immediately need to seize it instead of uh, constantly planning behind it because you will just waste your time planning over and over again as the situation will be very dynamic. We do have three fire cards here which, speak, which speaks for a lot of speed, a lot of dynamics. It, it, it speaks as well for a lot of surprises and if you are trying to secure all of your moves throughout the months, um, there will be always a surprising events along the way and therefore you will always have to adapt your plan here and there and for that reason your plan will never be perfect and as it's never perfect you will never going to act upon this um, this opportunity of yours or that surprise or this breakthrough should I say and as the month passes uh, you know you're gonna basically miss your chance so be a little bit more courageous and be a little bit more initiative this is what those couple of cards are asking from you the next card which is the nine of pentacles <clears throat> it does points to the challenges or rather like things which are causing predicaments and that will be with the page of swords so what we do have here is the expectations you may have uh, of the situation itself and it's not really a huge predicament it just points these couple of cards just point that that is just the very initiative or uh, initiation of the of the enterprise or of the undertaking either this is going to be a relationship new job or a new project and that the job is far from over i would have said it always uh, already here you know from the intentions but i just need to be um sure that that is going to be a thing for you because the six of wands it is the milestone but it is not the culmination 
so you have your breakthrough here and although you may you may kind of like expect that throughout the month this breakthrough is going to resolve ultimately is going to resolve your issues either career wise or relationship wise that is not going to be the case i mean you have quite a lot of road to walk and quite a lot of development to do that will follow up probably in the months after like march like april and etc etc and therefore you should not be how can i place it way too demanding about the results of your labor <clears throat> throughout this specific month. If you are after, for example, a huge deal for your private business, that deal may not gonna come throughout this month, but the very foundation of that deal, the, the very niche that you can enthrall this customer of yours is going to be revealed. And however, a, a, a hard work needs to be put from now on in order to uh, in order to kind of like consolidate or to seize that opportunity going <clears throat> further into the future or to close the deal now if we are following relationship thing however uh, when if if we are following this example that i gave you here being single and etc etc and now that could be the person <clears throat> here or you find a way how to mesmerize people or to enthrall people you know with your presence and etc etc the ideal guy or a girl may not come over this month but this month you will have the chance to polish those skills and when this guy or a girl comes around then you will have the chance you know or rather like you will have um the advantage to uh, to make your move and to you know close the deal for yourself and to have a relationship it is important here to know that what truly can obstruct you it's uh, it's the way you think and I will try to explain um, <clears throat> to explain that for you and that is by the way something um, uh, something very true for myself and what these cards are pointing is that what works for you may not work for someone else. What you think it's a virtue may not be a virtue for someone else, right? And especially that comes uh, very true when you are interacting with people. Your original thinking, it is something that deprives you from... Um, <clears throat> from reaching the ultimate success at least throughout the month and that's why kind of like you have to stick to the rules you have to stick to the code of conduct uh, if I may express myself that way your idea may be brilliant regarding career you know or <clears throat> the idea in general how to make a relationship could be as well brilliant but you may be left misunderstood from either your clients from either your boss or from the person that you want to be in a relationship with or from your wife or a husband for that matter so it's very important here throughout the <clears throat> throughout the month to elaborate yourself when you want to uh <clears throat> when you when you want to make a point and uh, how to elaborate yourself well if you uh if you're trying to explain yourself regarding in a certain activity you want to undertake here your explanations needs to be made in such a way that a, a kid in third in in a third grade needs to understand should be able to understand you all right so you shouldn't be a sophisticated when it comes to explanation of your actions and of your decisions as well so people can understand you and can see where you are coming from otherwise <clears throat> they will otherwise you will have to face predicaments as people will not be on the same page with you and people are to be involved into the majority of your situations and with that breakthrough as we are seeing that this breakthrough will require a recognition and in order for you to be recognized you are recognized from different people the next card that we do have this is going to be the guidance and we do have the four of swords here with the death card now what we do have here is a, a passive enemies uh, active enemies excuse me so <clears throat> Guidance wise, uh, you may kind of feel that you need to change something with you or to change something with, uh, with your plans or with your environment in general. And the change doesn't come there, the change come within yourself, just like I said here at the start. Yeah, the circumstances will give you an opportunity to act. <clears throat> 
but your actions or your initiation should be in the framework of your already developed envi developed environment and environment excuse me so for that reason here with the four of uh, swords and the death card it will be very important if you don't burn bridges that you have already established for yourself if they don't serve you any uh, any purpose at that very moment you can ignore them but you should not burn them so if this breakthrough kind of asks you to um stop working with someone or stop being with someone you know a friendship wise or career wise on etc etc that doesn't mean that this has to be the end of your friendship or the end of your cooperation you can uh, <clears throat> kind of put into slumber these activities for the months that are yet to come but you should not kind of like live in a in, with the bad terms with those people the uh, Four of Swords here is pointing that should you seek an advice, that advice can be given by a, a faithful companion of yours. On top of that, this is a card pointing that you should kind of be, um, how, can I how can I place it, your drive for it to, um, to manifest <clears throat> yourself to reach that recognition and to collect the fruits of your labor and etc etc should be made in a such a way that you don't confront people or rather like you don't initiate problems with others and as well uh, kind of like provoke rangos just to give you an example here <clears throat> again uh, let's say that you're not happy with your marriage and you are seeking a way to kind of like uh, dissolve the marriage and that according to these cards you know that way is going to be uh, presented to you throughout this uh, throughout this month but it's not going to happen exactly the way you think it's going to happen all right so you you have to be more like a, a prone to the um to the general code of conduct how one marriage is actually working how one divorce is actually working out so you have to be objective about the situation and most likely according to these cards this divorce is going to take time but what the guidance here says is that you should not cut ties with your wife or with your husband as they are yet to play a, a major role not major but important role in your future so you have to leave that marriage or you have to initiate that divorce in good terms and how this could happen well you kind of like <clears throat> it's not even a confrontation but more like a uh, open doors honest conversation with your husband or with your wife telling them what you are planning to do completely calm completely humbled and etc etc so they can understand you uh, where you're coming from and most likely uh, this undertaking here of um, you know of uh, um, of divorce is going to go smoothly yeah it's going to take time but it's going to be uh, rather smooth with uh, without any tantrums and uh, turmoils and at the end what we do have for you uh, Aries is that will be the Hermit card and uh, next one this is going to be the Seven of Cups so this is a, a very very potent combination while the Seven of Cups it points to fantasies daydreaming and unrealistic unrealistic goals the Hermit makes those goals completely realistic so what happens at the end is that based on this breakthrough and the recognition that you're going to have and not to um, <clears throat> and not to exclude the good terms that you're going to maintain with those situation or people that you are not going to work with or you're not going to be with any longer after this month your unrealistic goals until this very moment or not unrealistic goals but unreachable goals <clears throat> unmanifestable goals are going to become now into your grasp into your uh, into your reach and you will be able to uh, strafe into that direction however with uh, the hermit card this direction is only yours to take so it's going to be a, a singular um, uh, how can I place it 
is going to be a singular undertaking. What I mean is that you alone have to take on this road because there will be no one there to applaud you. And uh, doing so, uh, most likely you're going to find um, one of your callings or one of your paths, one of your um, one of your purposes, if I may express myself that way, because uh, the hermit is all about that um, analyzing oneself and uh, finding that light that shines for us in the dark tunnel. So. Um, it's uh, it's basically that's that guys uh, at the end uh, at the end of the month uh, for what it seems uh, you will kind of like make a a major turn in your life and that is going to be a turn for the better as a, a huge option available is opening for you based on the breakthrough that you will have throughout the month so it's very important that you don't neglect these fortunate circumstances happening and um, also the insights that you may obtain and again in order to take advantage of that or in order to manifest the breakthrough here you have to be courageous being scared and uh, being scared to act and to initiate and basically to jump into the dynamic of the daily routine simply going to deprive you from uh, from this um, goal which and which until now it's unreachable but is going to become within your reach when you actually take uh, when you actually manifest uh, your breakthrough through a uh, courageous actions so that being said Aries is this was your monthly tarot reading for February 2019 I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it and uh, once again that was a general reading for Aries star sign therefore is going to resonate in a different level with every single different one of you so uh, if you want your personal situation to be analyzed just like I did for the few examples here in this video that is a subject of a personal reading and for personal readings you can check out my website listed down below in the description of this video and there you're going to find a full list of my services as well as their pricing. Rod signing out now, see you next time, bye!